Hi, I'm Rob Zip, and I'm in Dallas, Texas to rainbow vomit. Blah! Right here, we're gonna go see some crazy interactive art stuff. We're gonna meet a guy named Rainbow Rob, just with one B. So come along and join me on the most epic adventures. Here's the train station for Fair Park. This is actually where I was last night for the soccer match. Barcelona versus Juventus. And then I got off the train, I was like, oh, there's rainbow vomit right there. I could have actually came here yesterday. I was early for the soccer match. But I'm here now and uh, Rainbow Rob is gonna give us a tour. So let's uh, let's talk to him. Now I, ha I am here a little bit early. I told uh, old Rainbow Rob I wanted to be here before they opened because I didn't want to get in the way of any of his customers. They're typically open at 2 p.m. Um, I think it's 2 to 8. But you can check out their uh, social media on their website to find out more. Actually, this place this place has been here since 2019. But, you know, with the pandemic and going on, they're trying to just re-up re um, the notoriety. Now, apparently they do a lot of targeted ads on social media. Social media uh, platforms that I'm not... A part of so I only heard about them by um, meeting some people and um, some people at the Dallas Fan Expo um, they told me about it I thought it sounded interesting and I told them I was coming up to Dallas uh, this week that I would love to stop by so um, Andrew hooked me up with Rainbow Rob he's the main guy here and hopefully we'll get to meet him soon but this, this has been here for a few years. There's some other videos that some other YouTubers have put out, but hopefully you enjoy mine as well. Rainbow Rob. Hello there, Rob. Thank you for welcoming me to Rainbow Vomit. First of all, people want to know why Rainbow Vomit? Why Rainbow Vomit? Well, uh, we are an immersive art exhibit. Um, this is a space where people come to explore with their friends and family, an artistic setup that's kind of designed as a comic book come to life. And we chose the name Rainbow Vomit because despite what you see in this room, it's like an explosion of color. Now we start off in this black and white room like a comic book, but it becomes more colorful as you explore inside. And then eventually you explore, you'll hopefully find the secret of Rainbow Vomit, a very special room that I'm sure our man Rob here will have no trouble finding. Finding, maybe with a couple of hints along the way. But why the name? Well, um, you know, it was inspired by something that would be memorable and okay. something that, you know, represented the sort of craziness that we have going on here. Sure. Rainbow vomit is like an explosion of color or a beautiful mess, as we like to call it. So it's kind of a juxtaposition of something beautiful that we all love, rainbow, with the sort of gross kind of vomit and uh, just makes something interesting, catchy, and we think represents kind of our identity in many ways. Awesome. Well, thank you for welcoming me here, and uh, hopefully my audience will appreciate this as much as I, I think it's awesome. From just the first room, Club Vomit the, <laughs> is the first thing. Our journey. Yeah, yes. you believe, and you can you can you know be in a band on the stage here. You can play the drums. You can sing. La 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 la. You even have the bubbles, the speech bubbles, the singing bubbles. See, this place is about kind of acting out like you're the hero of your own comic mm -hmm. book story. And, uh, you know, one of the fun things about these immersive exhibits is you can come and sort of be this different character in a unique setting. And it's a place where people can, you know, be their authentic selves and kind of feel like a kid again. That's one of our taglines is where adults feel like kids again. Awesome. Well, let's check it out. Yeah. Have fun exploring. Here we are in Club Vomit. I'm going to give you a full 360 view of each room. Get a little bit close in. Actually, drum kit. It's an actual bike. You get can't have something comic book related without having Stan the Manly. All right, we're leaving Club Vomit now. All these ribbons. A lot of a lot of ribbons and lights. Oh, and then here we are. And they have some ring lights. You can take some pictures here. They actually do have a tripod where you can set your, your phone up if you didn't bring your own. So let's check that out. Here I am. I'm in a comic book. Da, 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 da. Action! <laughs> oh 
Oh my goodness, an old school Southwestern Bell phone booth. Hi, yes, you're calling from the 80s? Okay, I can tell you, do not buy cryptocurrency. You'll hear all about it in about 30 years. Don't do it. Another photo spot. This place is really very much Instagrammable if you're on in the Instagram. And like you said, if you see an X, that just means that it's a supply closet. But this does not have an X. So what is in here? What? Secret passageways. <laughs> Do not touch the breakers, yes. Those are actual working breakers. Oh, and this is the bathroom. This is an actual working bathroom. So there's a secret door to use the bathroom. <laughs> Comic book pages. Orbeez! I bought a freaking unicorn! Yeah! There's a unicorn head in the freezer and some actual some drinks you can purchase, some Capri Sun. Capri Sun sounds perfect for this right there. I brought my own tripod, but they do have tripods here to set up. And I am using my Apple Watch also to help help me shoot some of these, but this is beautiful. I see you. <laughs> Trippy. There's even rainbow vomit coming out of the AC vents. All right, so we got a clue to get to the other room. It's somewhere over there. They're showing us. All right, let's 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 try these ribbons again. This room, it's over here somewhere. Oh, here's the door. We found it. We found it. We are in the rainbow vomit. Oh, wow. It's like what people say heaven is like. There's couches. Wow. Please do not touch or pick at the clouds. Yes. Oh, what a successful entryway. I'm flying away in a balloon to rainbow vomit. I'm a pretty butterfly. <laughs> panel of the comic book. The panels all along the way. And there we go. I discovered the secret to rainbow vomit. I made it. All these stickers, yeah. So once you get here, you get a free sticker. Awesome. This is going on the car. All right, we go back through Club Vomit and we exit through the gift shop where we enter. Here is the gift shop. This is, you know, where you enter as well. Rob is welcoming in. Rainbow Rob is welcoming in some, some more guests. So you've got some Andy Warhol stuff, some cool sunglasses, some unicorn headbands, slap bracelets, stickers. I already have a sticker, so I'm good on the sticker department, but I do need a pen. So they have the Andy Warhol pen, the classic comic book pal action pen. Exude love is trademarked. I'm gonna have to ask him about that. Uh, the rainbow moment, the little unicorn, the unicorn with the chainsaw, and the other, the other Wendy Warhol banana. They got some pop sockets. But I'm gonna get this one, this one right here. I'm gonna let him grab that for me. Got some some turds. I don't know what the turds are about. Some Orbeez or water water beads. So see how tiny they are, and see how big they were in the sink. <laughs> Fifty thousand beads. Holy goodness. They got a couple of books here. And they got some t-shirts. Cool shirts. And then some more stickers. Little, little unicorn stickers. Oh, these are these are uh, tattoos. Oh, but here are the prices. We didn't go through that, so they have different prices. Infants free. There you go.
All right, Rob, so I was just asking you, what is Exude Love? Because I see that is underneath your name. I see you have some um, pins that say that. It has the, the TM yeah. next to it. So. We certainly do, yeah. yes. Exude Love. Yeah, it's uh, one of the central themes of Rainbow Vomit. Um, you know, it's about cultivating love and acceptance within and exuding it into the world around us. And we actually started a nonprofit, the Exude Love Foundation, which has helped uh, put on some very special um, immersive interactive experiences here, all designed to kind of awaken people to the power of love and its transformative um, abilities. And you know, that's one thing that we really stand for here. We're going to utilize our nonprofit side to continue to build art that raises consciousness and vibration and uh, just lifts people's spirits. So exuding love is our, uh, is our motto, you could say. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed coming along with me to explore Rainbow Vomit here in Dallas, Texas, right across the street from Fair Park on Perry Avenue. If you haven't been here before and you're coming through Dallas, you gotta stop in. If you live in Dallas, this place has been here for three and a half years. You really should stop by. I know there's been a pandemic, but this is an awesome interactive art exhibit. We can take lots of great pictures for your Instagram or your Facebook or Snapchat or whatever, TikToks. There's lots of um, microphone stands, or not microphone stands, there's lots of camera stands for your phone specifically so you can take all the selfies and um, if you have an Apple watch or maybe a, a Samsung watch you can do the same thing where you can control the camera with your watch that is the way to go or bring a friend <laughs> but you, you don't have to have a friend if you want to come here and just take some cool some cool pics this place is definitely uh, one of the better interactive art exhibits in the country so Come along and join. Thank you for joining me on this episode of The Most Epic Adventures. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, slap that like button. If you're watching you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I come to places like this all over the country whenever I can, whenever I travel. And until next time, remember to drink water, listen to metal, enjoy nature, and have the most epic adventures. All right, this is bonus video time. Uh, this is gonna be longer than 20 seconds. He gave me three stickers. So since he gave me three stickers, I'm gonna put all three of them on the car. I was just gonna put this one that I got at the end, but he gave me these two as well. So they're all going on here. I think I'm gonna put them underneath my license plate here. It's just a, a little bit longer. The car's a little dirty but the stickers will stick on it fine. All right. So rainbow vomit exude love right here, right in the middle, right underneath my license plate. All right, here's the, uh, the unicorn. So, uh, it says rainbow vomit Dallas. I'll put you right here. And the I discovered the secret to rainbow vomit right here. So they're all all living gonna live together on my car, right above the wall drug stickers. <laughs>